Vanderpump Rules alum Rachel Levis is taking time to thank the real ones amid a major loss in her life. Though she claimed that she was going to live a much more low-key life and stay away from the drama, she has not been doing that. Now she is paying the price, and though she has recognized that, it is still never easy. So what is she thanking people for? Keep reading for more details. When Rachel Levis left season 10 of Vanderpump Rules, she went right into a mental health facility. There, she claimed she learned so much about who she was and real love. She understood that she was not really in love with Tom Sandoval after a months-long affair behind their co-stars' backs. It was up in the air as to whether or not she would return for season 11 as she was leaving treatment. There were alleged negotiations and she wanted a certain wage. In the end, she did not come back but did end up on Bethany Frankel's Just Be podcast, throwing everyone involved with Vanderpump under the bus. She then started her own podcast, Rachel Goes Rogue, where she has relentlessly talked poorly about the show and the cast. It made many wonder why she didn't just come back and say it to the cast's faces. Though she alleged she would be living a calmer life, Rachel has been all over the circuit, including multiple festivals. That has led her former fans to stop following her on social media. She took to her Instagram to address how she has lost 8k followers since she started sharing her festival life. Rachel wrote this. Welp, I've lost 8k followers since posting all my festival photos and videos. Oh well. Thank you to the real ones that have been supporting me and want to see me thrive. Illy here's a pic of me and that dandelion I love. Immediately her remaining followers chimed in with their thoughts and they did not necessarily think it had anything to do with festival living. After seeing her posting, followers responded to Rachel Levis. They said that they did not think she was losing people due to festival content. So, what were the comments like? I don't think that's why people are unfollowing you. I don't think it's the festival content, I think it's your inability to take responsibility and continue be a mean girl slash talking about BPR when you said you wouldn't. You probably lost followers because you're suing the woman whose life you helped to blow up. Some said they couldn't believe that they had not stopped following her. More so, they pointed out it was her behavior on her podcast, the way she spoke, and how she behaved with lawsuits that were the problem. Why do you feel Rachel is losing followers? If she took more accountability, could she get them back? Let us know in the comments below.